Elbow arthritis was a problem for a long time, but recent development in elbow atroplasty leads us to a point where we can treat arthritis with, a, with a atroplasty. However, the level of duration, so of standing time of the atroplasty is not, it's not, it's not the same as in the hip or in the knee. So what we should do before, uh, before recommendation for, for a patient to have atroplasty is we should check what is the reason, what is the age of the patient, what is the level of activity. All these points uh, are very important to give the patient the atroplasty he needs. For example, we can uh, have total atroplasty in elder patients, let's say at the age of 60 or 70, uh, with a lower level of activity. However, these atroplasties are not recommended for younger patients. In younger patients, we have the possibility of doing just atroscopy or in case of radiocapitular arthrosis, we can have an atroplasty, especially on the lateral column in the elbow joint. However, um, the conservative treatment is very important in the elbow uh, arthritis due to problems in the long term uh, when we're doing elbow atroplasty. So when a patient is coming to my, uh, to my hospital, we first see what is, his, uh, what is his pain level, what is his level of activity, what can we do for him in a conservative treatment. And if all this is uh, not leading to a better pain or functional situation, then we can see if atroplasty might be uh, indicated for him.